Hey everybody, we're, we're back in another Rayman. We're back with another video. These guys are trying to kill us. What's your opinion on yeah! this? Violence is bad. Violence is very bad. We need to kill them because violence is very bad. I don't want them in my Christian Minecraft server. You're not, they're not allowed in any of our Christian Minecraft servers. Yeah. They cost too much money. Yes. Here comes Fat Boy. Alright, there goes Glowbox to go kill himself. Uh, by going oh my to God. doctors. But first, uh, what we need to do is, uh, for those who are completionists, we need to go back here and check out the secret room that has all the, the gems in it. Like, smash my shelf. Get all oh the money. Oh, God. <laughs> Yay, it's so pretty. It's like uh, one of those other games I can't think of. Anywho, there's gonna be a cutscene, so uh, we're gonna have to shut the hell up because uh -huh. reasons. So, uh... <laughs> and I got subtitles on, so you'll know what they're saying, but you won't hear the dialogue. Oh. Thank you. Yes. Let's see what we have here. If you don't mind. Ah. Ah, I see you swallowed a black lump. We will need to resort to drastic measures. Rock music. Of course. Yeah. That's what it's actually saying. Mm. Oh, he's stubborn. I'm afraid that your problem is worse than I thought. You see, the Black Clumps has taken a refuge in a fistula by going through a kidney near a spare rib. You will need to consult a stomach specialist. I know a very good doctor who lives in the land of the living dead. I leave you now. I must go clean my instruments. So now we must go to the land of the living dead. That's where. He, that's what he said. That's a. Uh, ooh, colors, prettiness. Oh come on, drugs. Come <laughs> on, drugs. Yes. Uh, these are the the special stages. You get enough gems, and you unlock one at the end of each world. I'm pretty sure there's one at the end of each world. I've never gone to them all because I end up not collecting enough monies to get to them. I thought I was special. <laughs> but yeah, these are pretty. These are pretty groovy, I guess. You know, you're pretty groovy. So, uh, in one of the the videos, the last, uh. First three episodes where it was just me by myself. I said in one of them that there's always a point in each Rayman game where they take a a dark turn. In Rayman One, the dark mm -hmm. turn was how hard it was to complete it. And that's not that's mm -hmm. true. You had to actually 100% Rayman One to beat it. Oh. And uh, this game, or Rayman Two, was like the world's been taken over. We're all gonna die. That was the whole basis of that game. The world's been taken over by evil pirates or something. Oh! These are pretty hard too. In this game, uh... It's not, uh, this, this next, uh, world yet. This world ain't very dark, but... The world that comes after the Land of the Living Dead is pretty dark. And, uh... Landed. I think it's my favorite part of the game. Because of just the... The way the comedy of this game works, it just it, I think it's great. Some people think the talking, because this game has a lot of voice acting. People say it's really annoying. I I, I love it because I'm an uninspired, uncreative child who who doesn't know anything good. Anywho, oh my god, I am this spy. 
for game. Let's start referencing TF2 for, for no reason. Let's start referencing a bunch of TF2 books for no reason. Alright. I've been doing nothing but teleporting bread for the past three days. Same bitch. Same. For game. Same thatch. The characters of that game are so great. Yeah! Also, this is really hard. And there is an achievement on the Xbox 360 where you have- OH NO! We fall. I fell. I fell really far, and now I'm back to here. And oh god, right. ah, I'm falling again. Okay, cool. I 100% the level. I'm so happy. So mega awesome. Next bonus level in 5,000 points. And here's a not so nah. happy uh, beginning to a uh, level. Mm -hmm. Oh. She called me a pervert, what the hell? Okay, cool, Let's, There is a gem okay. inside the toilet. She shot out that she thing! She crapped a gem, what the hell? Wow, she must be good speed, so sweet! Yay, free money! Poo money! <laughs> free poo money! Poo money! We can make poo waffles. So, uh, here we get a new power-up. We get the, uh... The Mickey Mouse power up. Oh. Oh. Do oh. quick, do do, oh. Mick, do a Mickey Mouse voice. Oh, oh. You want to see some real speed? Oh. <laughs> Mickey Mouse is Sonic the Hedgehog. I want to I want to play the the Sonic the Hedgehog mod on Sonic Generations. Jesus. Well, you want to see some real speed, huh? The camera hates me in this game. Camera bad boy, no one likes him. Camera bad boy, camera be kinda gay though. Yeah. Yeah. Oh god, piranhas! Oh, piranhas! So here's something I don't understand about a number of the, of the Rayman games. Uh, or mm. actually no, Rayman 2. Why is just the entire ocean in Rayman 2 just full of piranhas? Piranhas bad boy. They don't like live in Amazon. Actually, I got I gotta ask you something. Uh, let me see where it is. It what is that thing? What? What is that thing? It's uh, my uncle. Like this thing it exists in this world. I don't know what this is. It's a hand on a head, and it's like a weird testicle king monster. It's my uncle. <laughs> What shall we name this thing? Um, King Louis the Third. Yeah, it works for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it works for me. Let's go with that. Yeah, it works. For that's me. canon. I'm sure there's a canon name, but you know what? No, that's canon. That's canon now. That's the canon name. This cannon's made out of cannon. Cannons. <laughs> cannon. Oh, look, another toilet. Great. I need- I- I didn't ask for all this potty humor in my Rayman game. Look at all this. Oh look, guy who's gonna give me a, f a free green gem. Gem. Give me a gem. Gem gem of gem. Yay! Free red gems! More poo money! Yay! Of course this game, Rayman, of course they would put a gem in the toilet. Because... What, what? Because obviously, uh, the gems, all the gems just come out of toilets. I think that's like the main problem in the world. Gems and she just said, call me a pervert! What the hell? <laughs> she just she called me a pervert! <laughs> Alright. Time to, time to destroy this evil witch. I think she's evil. Is she evil? I, think I don't she know. Just said, Damn it. Did she just say a bad word? <gasps> oh no, she said ribbon. That's what she said. Oh. Yeah, this is one she this was is the, uh, the boss of this world. Uh, so there's this there's this guy that shows up later, who's actually I supposed to be married to this lady. Oh god. And uh, and you know how you find that out? Mm -hmm. You actually go into this little camera mode and you like look at the character or something. Something oh, like that. God. I don't know. 
That's that's fun. I like it when games do that extra detail. I like it when games do that. Okay, you're supposed to you're supposed to hit her, and then she does this annoying running attack, which is just stupid, annoying, and bullcrap. It makes this funny noise. It makes this dee -dee -dee sound. That just yeah. looked like a freaking Tom and Jerry scene. Oh yeah, we're scene. both, we're both, oh my god. That's not supposed to happen. Oh, you're, you're a small boy. Small boy, I'm Sonic the Hedgehog! Sonic, he can live! I can, <laughs> Sonic, I can, he's got an attitude! I can probably quote that entire song in, in one try. Probably. I don't know. Uh, out of all the, uh, the Sonic cartoons, which one's your favorite? Sonic Underground. Oh, yeah. I never watched that one. I think it's poop. What are you- why? I don't know. I, I watched it- like, when I was a kid, I would watch all those cartoons off of YouTube because they're basically, like, public domain now. And mm -hmm. I watched the Sonic Saturday AM show first. And I loved that show, and I was ultra sad when I found out that it was it was like canceled for what was it Power Rangers or something back in the nineties? I don't know. But <laughs> it was like, Power Rangers. I honestly pref I I watched Sonic Sad AM and thought, nah, I don't I don't like this. I don't I don't like how they they made these because uh, like those the characters in that show were made for that show, and you will never see those characters in anything else ever again. <laughs> of course. That's the same thing for the other Sonic cartoon, the Sonic Set AM show. I just yeah. didn't really like it. Except all the 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 freaking the 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 funny uh, Sonic cartoon that makes no sense. I love that one. <laughs> I love Doctor Robotnik from that one. It's funny. Doc What's your Dr. opinion Redneck. on that one? It's fun. It's good. Yeah. Uh, Sonic Boom, what's your opinion on that? Oh, I, heard, I haven't seen that one. It's really funny. Really? Yeah, it's a really, like, the Sonic Boom cartoon was really funny. <laughs> like, there were a lot of inside jokes they did, making fun of Sonic. Uh, how? Like, saying, like, you know how, uh, like, the, the old people say the old games are great and the, the new games suck? Mm -hmm. They made that sort of joke. Like, there's a... There's a scene where they come up with this fictional game parody of, like, son the original Sonic games, and they're like, the, the, the future games suck because like, they, they did a thing, and stuff. They, they're like that. <laughs> yeah. Also, look at this. These two guys over here, they're playing cards. Huh. <laughs> ah, take that! Oh, man, you were totally winning, too. Here, you have the royal flush. You have the royal flush. <laughs> yeah. I I want to destroy piggy bank. Piggy. Money. It's Peppa Pig. God, Peppa Pig is a terrible show. <laughs> and I know I know a good kids show when I see it. Peppa Pig's not that. Peppa Pig teaches kids bad morals. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm I'm serious. I'm not saying this as a joke. Peppa Pig is a legitimately bad kids show. What do you think? It's god awful terrible. Now, a good kids show is a uh... crap. What's a good kids show? Ah, uh, wait. Uh, if I can't remember, um... I'm trying to think. Like. I can't remember for some reason. Was Dora the Explorer a good kid show? Well, for us, yeah. So I, I can't remember. Like, I remember growing up watching that show, like... Do you see the thing? It's... <laughs> Say so you stupid! <laughs> it's like... <laughs> oh yeah, also, go Diego, go. Oh, I remember that was a, the spin-off of Dora the Explorer. That was like a spin-off. Yeah. That was good. That was a good show. I, I remember yeah. watching that one, I think, a bit more than Dora. I think... I mean... Oh, Backyardigans. Backyardigans was good. 
Oh yeah. Backyardigans was Wait, really which good. Which one's your favorite character though? Which, which one was your favorite character of the Backyardigans? It's been so long since I watched that show. I think. What was the name of the the penguin guy? What was his name? Oh. Oh God. I don't remember. Guys, tell us in the comments, please. Oh no. <laughs> Uh, I remember, uh, freaking, was one of them Uniqua? Was one of them named Uniqua? Uniqua? Freaking, I think, oh, uh, everyone always made the, the Mexican joke with the, the penguin character. His name was Pablo! Pablo, yeah, that's what his, that's what his name was! That's what his oh name was! Oh my god! That's what that was his name, Pablo. Oh my god. That's what his name was. Jesus Christ, and the funny thing is we have like a little stuffed animal of him. Oh yeah, I think I remember that. I might remember that. Oh, oh my god, it's been so freaking long. It's been so long. It's the the freaking intro. It's been too long, too long since I watched those kids shows. I remember having Loads of DVDs to him. Oh god! Like, actually, the one show, the one kid show I had the most DVDs of was Thomas and Friends, Thomas the Train. That is dope. Uh, I mean, uh, let me be serious. The first few seasons of of Thomas the Train were actually very, very good. For some reason, my family got the um British version, and. I, when people go by Bruce on top and hat, I call him the Fat Controller. Well, it was originally a British show, Thomas and Friends. Yeah, I know. And uh, yeah, that was what they called him, the Fat Controller, <laughs> in the British the fat show. Controller. I, I remember uh, later one season uh, was voiced by, uh, or was yeah, like they 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 re they would redo. Uh, the seasons, I think, with different narrators every once in a while. One of them was with George Carlin, the the funny comedian who makes very inappropriate oh jokes. George Carlin. Oh my god! No, that's true. George Carlin was a very inappropriate com comedian, and he narrated Thomas and Friends, Thomas the Train. That's what me and my brother would call it, Thomas and Friends. Thomas the Tank and Dankin. Thomas the Tank and Dankin. <laughs> Where'd that come from? Thomas the Tank and Dankin! Yeah, I have strong nostalgia for Thomas the Train. And I think one season was narrated by, uh... Friggin... Alec Baldwin? You're kidding! I'm not kidding. I'm serious. Oh my god. One, I, I think, it might have been two seasons, it was narrated by uh, the boss baby himself. That no. sucks. <laughs> oh god. It's true though, it's true though. I'm gonna have to look this up afterwards. <laughs> you, you can search it up now if you want. Oh, I can do it later. I have time. Good god. Oh, crap, what am I supposed to be what am I doing here? Okay, I need the green power up so I can uh get do, do the twister thing to the thing. Twist your thing to the thing. Yeah. Alright, go. Hey, you know what's funny? When you have a power-up, all the gems are worth double. But when you get hit without a power-up, uh, you lose one gem. When you get hit with a power-up, you, you lose two gems. <laughs> That's stupid. <laughs> That's so stupid. I love that. Oh, oh no, not the piranhas! Yeah, kids, the piranhas. this episode of uh, of the Hat Boys, they, the guys talk about... Many, many kids shows they used to watch when they were kids. Yeah. I'm not finding a good point to end this episode on. Oh, whatever. Alright, what, what was another kid show? That was um, like, What was another kid show we watched when we were kids? That was very highly regarded in aspects, sort of ways. Um. Uh... Alright, what about modern modern kid shows? What's a good modern kid show that's airing now? Pet 
Peppa Pig. God, no. <laughs> what? I don't like Peppa Pig. Peppa Pig what? is trash. <laughs> Peppa Pig is a trash cartoon. It has been airing <laughs> since, like, the 2000s, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. That's the thing, Peppa Pig's been airing for so long. Like, that, that, that shit has to die. <laughs> yeah, it has to, yeah. It has to. all these gems I just got, man. It's freaking. Look at this scary tree. Spoopy. Spoopy, Spoopy month. When it's October, I'm gonna make a Spoopy month Twitter post. I'm gonna animate. It's I'm gonna Spoopy animate month. Hattie doing the Spoopy month dance. Oh my! I have to do that with Brian as well. Oh my! Yeah, God. we had to do that. It's yeah! Month. We had an idea. We have an idea. Now I must do it. We have an idea! Let's do it right now! Yes! <laughs> yes, only the most... The most 10 out of 10 uh, commentating from the, the Hat Boys on the, the YouTube channel, Ethan8138. Yes. Where am I uh, supposed to be going? Oh, crap. Stuck. Jump all premise. The lock shot uh, power-up is what this is called, I think. And double money. Yeah. Oh. Uh, let me go in the jump! Alright, that was the end of the oh. Alright, gonna end it off here, guys. I will see you guys later. Peace.